Hi, I'm Mary Rogers, and this is the Cuisinart two pound bread maker. It has a lot of great features and functions, so let me take you through them. But first, the one thing I want to mention to you is one of the hardest things for um, cooks to make in the kitchen is bread. Bread can be um, very complicated and complex to make, but when you have a bread maker, you can make your own fresh bread at home without having to worry about the complications of making it. So first and foremost, the great thing about this bread maker is it has three sizes. So it makes one, one and a half, and two pound loaves. It also has three crust types that you can program it for, light, medium, and dark. And it has a lot of other great features and functions too. But some of the breads that you can make are basic white, French Italian, whole wheat, a sweet bread. You can make gluten-free bread, which is really important because a lot of people are following a gluten-free diet right now. You can also ha um, do packaged mix. So if you're not going to put all the fresh ingredients together yourself, you're going to use a packaged mix. You can use a program function for that. It has um, cake and quick bread. So if you're going to do any type of like banana bread or cake bread, regular dough, pasta dough, believe it or not, jam, and you can also use a bake-only function. It also has a rapid bake feature. It has a 13-hour delay start, so if you want to set it up the night before, program it so that you come home to beautiful, fresh, homemade bread, you can do that too. It has a nice silver finish. Um, the lid here is removable, and it also has a little window on the top so you can actually watch the progress of your bread. It has a removable bread pan. You just twist and lift. And also the other nice thing is the um, dough blade right in here, which actually mixes your dough, is removable. And the nice thing about that is that when your bread gets to the stage where um, you, want, you, you have the ability to move, remove this paddle, um, it will make for a really beautifully finished loaf because you won't have the hole of the paddle inside. So that's a really great added feature. So in a few minutes, what we're gonna do is gonna get all ready and we're gonna make some bread. Today we're going to make sun-dried tomato and mozzarella bread. It's going to be really tasty. So first all we do is open the lid and it's important to put the ingredients in in this order. So make sure you check your IB and follow the instructions because it's very important to get the perfect finished loaf of bread. So first we're going to add the water right in the bottom and then this is our sugar. We're going to add the sugar next and then the salt and then next, we're going to add the flour. This is our herb mixture. I'm going to add that on top of the flour. And the last ingredient that we're going to add is our yeast. Put that right on the top. And then we're going to close the lid. And I just want to um, mention here in the front, we have our mozzarella and sun-dried tomatoes. What we're going to do is wait until it gets to the process where um, you can add your mix-ins and that's when you would incorporate that later. So now we're going to go ahead and program the bread maker. First we're going to pick our loaf size and today I'm going to do two pounds. So I set it on two. Next I'm going to pick my crust color and remember it's light, medium, and dark. Today I'm going to do medium. And then I'm going to pick the menu. And Remember there's 12 menu options here. It automatically um, will default to one and that's the one I'm going to use today. If you want to change it, just press the menu button until you get to the numbered menu you want to use. And then all you need to do is press start. Look at this beautiful tomato and mozzarella bread. Remember I told you I was going to add those ingredients in mid-cycle? And I did, and look how nice it came out. It couldn't be easier to make fresh homemade bread with your Cuisinart bread maker.